as I'm descending these steps that Holly and I built to make it easier to navigate this hill into the forest, it's going to come down here, another step in here, and then I want to naturally curve it this way and possibly set up a seating area here so you can kind of look into the forest there and see the creek that's kind of running from the rain. And then as it comes down here, it's going to curve. And as we continue down to the this forest floor, this will be kind of all leveled off so it's not up and down. But then as they proceed to take the trees out that have red X's on it, they will uh, open this area up and you can kind of see as you pan around to the back, it's kind of flat in here. Mm -hmm. And so thinking that it's going to be a nice, peaceful, quiet area. And you see the dappled sunlight come through. And hear the birds. And the creaking of the trees as the wind blows higher. And then as it, there's probably 50 yards of this nice level flat land that we could remove these thickets of brush and what have you. And by continually pulling them out, improve this area so that it becomes a natural setting. And that you would want to come down here and just sit quietly and maybe see a deer, a squirrel, all kinds of wildlife that have been passed by you. So it's a very unique way to ensure that wildlife comes and takes a drink from the stream we're going to use. So thank you, Lord Jesus, that you have blessed us with the beauty of your trees in this land.